All right, this is Sean with Face Down Media, and we are with uh, a couple members of the group Necro Goblican, and you guys uh, are uh, Goblicon. Goblicon. Yeah. Goblicon. It's like Necronomicon with a gob instead of a nom. I should know um, that. I love Evil Dead. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. It's derived yes. from awesome. Yes. High five over Skype. <laughs> nice. That was a good one. All right, and you guys are. Uh, my name is uh, Nicholas Von Doom. It's my real name. And I'm Alex Alareza. I play guitar. I play uh, the, the pipes of the vocal chord. Very good. Predominantly. Uh, <laughs> now I see you have a new teaser video for your upcoming EP Power. Uh, what can your When can your fans be able to expect to get their hands on it? I love how you say your upcoming EP Power. It's just, it makes me think of Europe, which was a great time. Uh, <laughs> I think that the fans can probably expect it at some point. Hopefully before they die. Which, to be honest, maybe sometime before next year. Yeah, I think it's it's coming out. I think next. Oh. Yeah, we can't say it. Sure, it's but, coming soon, but, no. but yeah, don't worry but, about it. It's fine. But, <laughs> but probably like next season, I would say. Okay, I won't say nothing. I swear. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about, really. Exactly. <laughs> what are you? Hello, do we have connection? Yes, we do. <laughs> All right, now um, I did watch the the teaser video, which was great. You're not Illuminati, are you? No, I wish. They, they don't pay me enough for that. Uh, <laughs> now, who, who came up with the storyline behind your uh, video teaser? Uh, that was uh, our friend, Brandon Dermer. Oh, wait, and me. It was both of us. We were just... I forgot. Yeah, we, we, had a, we were rehearsing, and it was just right outside the rehearsal space, and there was an idea of doing some kind of teaser showing a little... Oh, bit. no, no, that was just... Oh, the teaser video. The teaser video, yeah, yeah. That was just... I that's what we're talking about, right? It's yeah. what we were doing at the time. Yeah. It was. It just happened to be filmed. There was no real storyline. That's just... We were there with the goblin, who was actually real, and we were just hanging out, and that was just a portion of a snippet that had been filmed. It's and that's how it went down. That's what our lives are like. Always. It's what we're always doing at all times. So... You know, it was just a snippet of a flash of a portion of one s moment of ordinary life, I I would probably say, myself. Now, speaking but of goblins, now, what about John Goblicon? Uh, how did you guys, you know, get in contact uh, with him? I don't think he's really, really happy uh, to be mentioned. Sort of he's a little shy, but we're trying to get him out there. You know, he's yeah. He feels he feels like you know too much attention's on him right now. He's going through a rough time. See, the thing is that he crash landed here on Earth not too long ago, and he's he came to the band because he knew about you know the Goblin connection. Yeah, and then you know the next thing he knows, everyone knows about him from YouTube, and he doesn't know these people and doesn't right. know if they're like right. He's why they sensitive. like it. I mean, it's just like you know. Yeah. You or me. I or you. But he said he's a goblin. Right. But I mean, you know, goblin is goblin. <laughs> God. Yeah. I say. Now, you guys have been touring a lot with bands like Cold Chamber, In This Moment, Escape the Fate, uh, touring overseas. How would you rate your tour Those are all experience? very ominous names. I just want to point that out. <laughs> <laughs> like, Escape the Fate in this moment. The Cold Chamber. Like, ah! It was <laughs> It was, it was a lot of fun. Yeah. And um, have you noticed any of the other bands not being human like you guys? Yeah, it's weird because we are actually human. I just want, I just want to address that. Um, we are indeed human. Yes. Precisely human so far. Fortunately, human and uh, from every perspective, uh, clearly human. It's just what we represent as people and as species. Um but the other bands, I uh, may have questioned slightly. I, I don't. I don't quite get the question. I'm not sure about their humanity. Wait, wait, is it, the, it, they may not have been humans. Uh, they might I not. Think yeah. That's all he's asking. But we are humans. Yes. So that's cool. Yes. Bro. All right. 
And now you guys are you were described as a yeah. band about many wonderful demise of mankind. Care to elaborate? Yeah. I mean, I feel like it explains itself to a degree, honestly. But, I mean, I, I think that, you know, combining fun and the demise of mankind is a time-tested tradition that we choose to honor because our goblin enforcers... Uh, make it so that we have to brutally it's true we're doing this against our will scotlands are holding us captive giving us stupid nicknames it's all they do yeah and, you know just making us play metal but but they don't they don't have a any way to detect skype so we're safe yeah <laughs> that's it's the only thing they don't have for some reason yeah i'm, I'm not ready there. to be a goblin yet yeah yeah we could keep now, how, how did you guys come in contact with the goblins? Uh, well, it was this mysterious box in the woods, actually. <coughs> I was in the woods. Yeah, sorting through boxes. <laughs> we were sorting through boxes in the woods and the forest. <coughs> and these goblins right, it's terrible. had left us this. About it. This is terrible. It's okay, man. <coughs> I'm out of breath Put again. Put your hands back on. <coughs> All right. Alright, okay. but uh, so there was this box in the woods. Yeah, yeah so there's a box in the woods. We opened up the box, and inside it, we found a slip of paper encrusted with some foul stench, glistening with crest. And uh, once we had broken apart and peeled the layers of the crusty, stenchy paper, we found nothing. And it was just an old piece of paper. And uh, at that point, uh, we were we were uh, caught in one of those nets that you see on old TV shows because it was made by goblins, and they caught us in the net. And at that point, they were like, you have to start a band. And we're like, well, we're just like, you know, not that into music and such and such. You know, they weren't hearing. Yeah, we were all about sports before this. We were about then, sports. You know, but now yeah. it's... So it was weird. Metal this, metal yeah. that, double bass. They catch you in a net, and that's how your life turns out, so... Yeah, next question. <laughs> uh, now, what's next in store? I know, I know that you guys have your EP. Uh, what else do you have lined up to continue your your wonderful demise of mankind? Several uh, sex videos. <sighs> sex videos. Yeah. That's our next phase. Yeah. We're actually going to make stop making music after this. Yeah. It's just going to be sex videos. It's not going to be hot or anything. It's We're looking really at the profits, but, mainly. But it's, I mean, like a series of sex videos yeah. about profits. Profits, yeah. Yeah. We'll have money Pro fucking money. <laughs> on. I mean like, you know, prophetic Oh profits. Profits. Uh, so PH, yeah. We'll have it fucking money. Yeah. Uh, hopefully we don't get bombed for saying we that. We have to censor that. But yeah. Let's just pretend that one didn't happen. Yeah, that didn't I don't know what are we talking about. Never heard something. I don't know. Yeah. It's good. All right, well, I do t uh, thank you guys for taking the time. Wait, out wait, to wait, wait. There was, a, like, uh, I feel like there was more last time. Is there another question? No, I'm not sure. Was there another question? We, do we, we, got, we got it all? Up, really. um, unless you want to, you know, give any interest in facts to your fans. Oh, yeah. Uh, our new EP is called uh, Time Spent Well in a Cave. It's coming out uh, October uh, 1945. And it's uh, very hurtful to your feelings as a soul and being. It's a malicious piece of art. Precisely. <laughs> but that's it. Yeah, just that. Nothing else. But also expect it and like be ready because, you know, it is good and it's coming out soon. And it's real. It definitely actually it exists. exists. It exists. That's yeah. all we want to say. They do exist. Yeah. It exists. Yeah. With all right. that. Excellent. Now, again, I do thank you guys for taking the time out again and, uh, you know, that yeah, gives props out to Outer Loop Management for this. For sure. Thanks, man. Not a problem. And uh, when you guys uh, do your new uh, uh, EP out and got some more stuff coming out, maybe we'll do a follow-up again. Sounds good. Definitely. As soon as we have a clearance, we can continue this discussion. Excellent. All right. Again, this is Necrogoblican. Con. Necrogoblican. Con. Yeah, like, like this is a con. Like we're just you know like con. It's like if we had our own con, like Comic Con. 
called Necrogoblin Con. It's my know? horrible accent. That's what it is. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. I was, didn't realize. It. Sorry, my bad, dude. No offense. <laughs> sorry, I <we> love you. <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> it happens We're to the friends. best. We're friends, it's cool. Chumps. Excellent. We'll say we'll go to your your state someday. Say hello. I do hope so because I am also a big fan, and uh, I know you guys have a lot of you know fans following you guys, and uh, just can't there wait to see what's next. All over the world. We're trying to. We're hopefully going to be touring the states someday. So like, yeah, fingers yeah. crossed. Yep. Yeah. Finger is very crossed. Yeah. Sure. You all right. That's our business fingers. Yeah. And a uh, shout out to Brad from Outer Loop Entertainment for making this Brad, happen. It's actually Brad, dude. His name is McDuck. McDuck. Yeah, his name is McDuck. I promise you he will appreciate that. Shout out to McDuck. All right. So when I get a hold of him, I'll just say, hey, McDuck, what's going on, man? Brad, yeah, yeah. He will yeah. definitely love that. Definitely. <laughs> I actually no, like that name really... better than the other one, too. So. Right? Yeah. Yeah, if I can make Reminds me of Howard the Duck. Yeah, what a weird movie, you know? <laughs> I got a phone call. Uh-oh. All right, guys. Well, Uh-oh. I'll let you get back to what you're doing. You, yeah, same hey, here. I've got Brandon. Wait, I've got Brandon Dermer on the phone here. Brandon, are you there? How's it going, Nick? Hey, you should say hello to this guy over Skype through the internet. <laughs> hello. What's going on, man? Stop. Sean from Face Down Media. Sean from oh, Face Down Media. So I don't think you can hear you. I tried. Okay, it's fine. Goodbye, Sean. All it's right. Nice. See you guys <laughs> later. You have a good one. More catch up.